Hey guys, Mad Max here uh, with a video that has nothing to do with my other videos. I actually ordered all the parts. I I actually ordered all the parts for a 3D printer, except the electronics. And today I will start to build a 3D printer. So, just that I have a video that I can watch in a couple of years, I will make a time lapse video of me actually putting this together. Uh, it's pretty easy. You just need five of those stepper motors. Uh, you have a couple of threaded rods, a couple of smooth rods, and printed plastic parts. They actually have pretty high quality. And you could probably see that. You see that it's printed out, right? And it's pretty cool. I mean, I can print those parts with this machine, so it's kind of reproducing itself. Alright, uh, I think without further ado, let's start music, because I will need music. I think there's actually a part missing. That's pretty unsettling. I don't have M8 washers. I have those, but I need 70 M8 washers. Yep, they forgot the washers, and there's no real reason to start without the washers. I can't do anything without those washers. So, I just stop recording and go buy them right now. Alright, just came back from the hardware store where I buy 200 M8 washers. I actually only need like 80, but I have 93 nuts because they are spares. And uh, actually, as it turns out, 100 individual M8 washers cost as much as 200 pre-packed. So that's a difference of, uh, I think, 90 cents. And you can never have enough washers, man. Trust me when I say that. You can never have enough washers. Alright. I mean, just think about all the stuff you can do with washers, right? You can use them to separate your nut from whatever you're doing. You can use them as spacers and as washers. Seriously, dude, they are only washers. Don't get overexcited.